Welcome everyone. Today is August 26, 2019. Here to give you all the news according to the charter update for Binance. It's been about six days since we did our video for Binance and being fully transparent with you all, you're going to tell that the market did not go the way that we expected it to go in Binance. So <clears throat> we're going to talk about that momentarily, but I had to let you all see this article right here about Binance. Now they have a new lending platform. You can earn crypto while you sleep. You can earn more Binance, Ethereum Classic, and even Tether while you lend out your cryptocurrency to margin traders. This came out today. Binance is launching this new crypto lending platform, Binance Lending, on the 28th of August. We're going to see if this is going to have an impact on the price for Binance, if we're going to see higher prices or a continued movement to the downside so i'm not going to dwell here too much on this article i definitely wanted to inform all of our viewers that this is coming out on binance and seemingly looks as if binance is going hard in this cryptocurrency space seemingly they always got something coming out almost every day that they're trying to implement in the cryptocurrency market so keep your eyes open on binance we wanted to give you all an update on the price chart regarding this news. Plus, we're going to see that Binance did not go according to our plan. After we did our video right here on the 19th of August, two days ago, two days since that video, we got stopped out. 5.34% loss in the market in Binance. Chop that up, move on to the next trade. You will have those sporadically in your trading adventures. Now, I want to switch this over. Oh, I want to zoom out. I want you all to see that we're noticing some changes occur in the market in Binance. This has been the long term trend in the market in Binance for a while, at least since February of 2019. This market has been trading above this ascending line recently starting the 21st of august we broke that ascending line we are noticing some weakness appear in the market in binance something we got to start taking note of last week even weakness is present on the weekly time frame that is not positive to note for the long term monthly time frame we're closing at the low of this current monthly bar even though we still have five days before the month of august price bar is completed we have to function and already anticipate that weakness is definitely present in binance okay so with all of those things that i just mentioned we are going to look for binance to see lower prices Okay, right around this particular area, uh, I will say $25, $25.10 cents to be TP. So let's see how much that would be. It'd be about 3.7% profit in the market for that uh, in Binance, okay? So TP $25. $25.10, but when you look at it on the weekly time frame, if that, this area right here, $24 is not maintained, look for around $23, maybe even $22 to be support, okay, in the long term. Now, I'm not seeing that yet, but just something to keep on your in the back of your mind as we see this currency trade against the dollar okay so we're looking for this market in binance to move to the downside specifically in the long term uh, as well we can even see it on the daily time frame too okay tp is around 25 dollars and 10 cents if we see 
some strength coming to the market like we did here on the 17th of July. OK, there you are. Pretty good news that they're coming out with the landing platform to where you can continue to accumulate more Binance, Tether or even Ethereum Classic tokens without actually trading. Read up on that article if you're interested. Make sure you all maintain your profitability and tell me what you think with a comment in the comment section of this video about that lending platform that they're creating. And then join us at our website at hughfinancial.com. I'll see you all on the next one.